Alright. Alright, so I, like, I was looking at some places, and um, I think I'm ready to buy a house. So, I'm gonna... I think the realtor is on his way. I don't know yet, but... um. But yeah, he's gonna show me a couple places, and... Uh, yeah. I'm gonna see if I can buy a house today. Alright guys, so I just talked to the realtor, he gave me a um, location to meet him at, I think this is going to be the first house, so uh, yeah, so we're going to just go check him out and then um, see what happens, you know, I'm going to try speed there because I don't want to keep him waiting for too long. Alright, so we just arrived, um, yeah, let's just see what's going on here. I can let's tell look. you're directionally challenged. You know, it's one thing, you know, when you, uh, yeah. when you text me with this, the postal numbers and no street address, I got a little confused. What's my map? Well, it's, uh, my GPS. Th there's only one street that 4013's on, and it is literally right here. Yeah, and, uh, yeah, I guess you're right. <laughs> I tried putting it in my yeah, GPS, my I, GPS wasn't, I, wouldn't load. Yeah, yeah, I gotcha, gotcha. Well, um, you said you were uh, interested in buying a house? Yeah, yeah. I, um... You know, I'm just tired of, you know, sleeping in the shop all the time. Well, this is the ones that I have up. It's not very big, but it's quaint. You know... Got everything that I mean, comes with it. It's nice. It's, like, close to the... It's close to the shop, you know, I can just drive home and... It wouldn't take me too long to get to work. Yeah. You mind if I go like take a walk around real quick? Uh, I'll walk with you. All right. So this is, is a pretty nice. Is you want to know about this property? Yeah, like who's the previous owner and like was there any like kind of police activity here? You know? Uh, not that I know of. All I know is that they uh. Happened to depart this world in some sort of accident involving some homemade. Oh, all right. Yep. Not on the property, of course. They had drove out to the dunes. Uh, you know the ones near the recycling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know those ones. Yeah, he thought he was going to fly into space, and he he did not. Gotcha. So. That's uh, that's a very interesting story. I, I had a buddy who thought, you know, meth is a pretty hard drug. Uh, this is just one of them conspiracy theorists. Ah, uh, okay. Anyway, what's the retail value on this? Uh, I'd say, well, it's set up for sixty-four, but honestly, it's probably worth maybe sixty. Maybe sixty. I mean, it's pretty but nice. But I'm always just, like. I'm always willing to negotiate on prices. All right. Uh, well, one thing, one thing I'd really do not enjoy about this place is the garage. Is that only a one-car garage? Ah, uh, yes, I believe so. Gotcha. I, uh, I much prefer something with a bigger variety of uh, places where I can store my vehicles. I got, I got a trailer. I got a truck. I got, a, I got this car right here. And I got a bunch of like project cars that I'm working on right now. I don't know. Oh, you... Projects? That's cool. Yeah, yeah. And then, um, yeah. So, uh, you got any you got any properties with a, I don't know, some kind of bigger storage for cars uh, and stuff? Let, let me think. I, I, this is. I, I'm not sure right now. Um, I've got some more, uh, I have one inside of, uh, I have two inside of Grapeseed, one that's on Main Street. It's got a little bit bigger. I guess we could check that one out. Yeah, yeah, uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's not too much bigger, but it might be good enough for you, plus you could always expand into the uh, property behind it. Alright, I'll follow you there.
Alright guys, so like, I am very stickler about that place. That place looked like a straight up crack house. Um, and I'm pretty much been in for 60k. I mean, that's a good price for it. But like, I don't know. It's a, it's a weird thing. And plus, I need, I need storage. I need it. I need a place to be able to store stuff and work on stuff and it's just, uh, a one car garage is really bothering me. Plus there's no other spots to be able to park my cars except the driveway and front lawn. And I'm not trying to be messy here. Yeah, but if you guys haven't yet, make sure you like and subscribe. Um, I'm enjoying this so far. And uh, the, this is the fourth episode. And... Um, you know, and everyone on the server, I have to say, is they're very nice. We're they're really good about keeping RP RP and trying to keep unnecessary stuff out. Uh, they're good about ha handling fail RP. Um, and if you guys want to be able to join a server like this, you know, look it up. It's in 5M. Um, it's called Law Enforcement Lifestyle RP. It's it's honestly ever since I joined this, I've been on this server prob probably about two months, and it's been a really great, really great so far. So this is a lot less of a home and a lot more of a garage, I guess you could say. You know, if anything, oh. it's 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 pretty big and it's nice, a little bit spacious, you know. But yeah. Like I said, there Ooh. is no home on the property. Okay. Um. By the know, way, what, what? this one and that one are two separate properties, and I do not own that one. Oh, okay. So this is just more of like the garage. Yeah. All right. Um. So yeah, I, I need a place to sleep. <laughs> uh, yeah. Well, okay, I, can I do always like tell you this, and one of the houses down there, because I own a house down there too. Okay, uh, let's go check those out. Okay, I only own one though. Yeah, that's fine. This garage would be perfect. Everything I would be able to do, I can just go in there, work on my stuff, and then... Yeah, and plus I can keep ever, all my stuff in there. It'd be so nice. Um, so yeah, I think... I'm sold on that garage, but I want to see this house. And just how far away it is from that garage. Alright, so it's like down the road a little bit from the garage. Yeah, it's a little far. But, of course, I would sell you them together. Alright. I mean, I, I love that garage. Um, you know the history on this house? The garage itself, it, uh, I actually, I do not know the history. Oh, I do. I remember. This house belonged to a uh, to the previous commissioner of the San Andreas State Police. Oh, okay. So Jacob Thompson. Okay. He was uh, he was shot and killed in a police shootout where he was shooting at the police. It was a big scene inside of the uh, tattoo parlor inside of uh, Sandy. Oh, okay. So he he passed away. But with him being the, I mean, ex-commissioner and all, it, this building's probably up to code well, and everything. It's not a very legal commission, I'd say. Before he was, you know, not commissioner anymore, he was wanted for um, felony evasion and uh, drunk driving. It was all over Twatter, you know? 
Oh, it must have been before I moved here. Probably. No, that's, um, I mean, it's a pretty sturdy house. Uh, this does definitely in my interest. Uh, how much, how much are you, uh, asking for it? Uh, this house alone, it, uh, I'd say 80. 80? 80? Yeah, but the, uh, what's the thing, uh, the, the shed in that property over there, not shed, the garage in the property and everything on that property, that's going to be around 25 to 30. 25 Depends to on whether 30. or not you would like to buy, um, there's a little bit extra of the property back there. I actually planned on building up there, but, you know, buy it off, that'll be 30. So, all together, it'd be, uh... 120? Uh, 110. 120. 110. Yeah. Okay. Um. Is there any other properties that you have, or is that pretty much all? This I'm just trying oh, to crap. keep my options. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Um. I do have one more. One more. Sorry. I have an earpiece in, and uh. Yeah. No, you're all good. You, know, you got to take care of business. Yeah. Yeah. I you got to put I bread on the plate, you know. Business, so. No, because I do make that bread. All right, so that's pretty promising, and um, depending on what this last house looks like, uh, I might get that bundle deal, and then just work to pay it off. Um, but yeah, let's uh, let's see where this uh. This last one is. And to be completely honest, like, we're starting to get really far from the mechanic shop. But, you know, a home is a home. It doesn't matter where it is or how far it is. When you can make it work, you can make it work, you know? Where is he taking me? Okay. Does that sign say farm? I would definitely love to be on a farm. Oh, there's a bridge to it too. This is perfect. Next time, you should leave with this. <laughs> uh, man, it's always good to go all places in between, you know? Yeah, because, like, I am... This place is beautiful. You got the you got a greenery house over there. The house actually looks really nice. and You know, you got, like, room for improvement. And the barn. That's a... Decent size far barn. Yeah. So, yeah, let me just take a look in here. Oh my god. I got room for my tools. I got room for cars in here. And I also got room to work on cars here. This is perfect. And it's all in one location, uh. too. I love it. Oh, you've also got some cows. All I ask is that if you do buy the property, do not kill the cows. Alright. I you know, I can always run the farm too. How, how much are you asking for this place? Uh, this one's gonna be, uh... I believe this one is up for 120 right now. 120? Yeah, main, and that's kind of low. But I mean, its location, it's it's in an extremely place with its own private road. This, this is what I wanted. 
and it would be completely fair is the same price as the other house like the house and the barn and i don't have to drive that far i don't have to drive at all to get to two places yeah especially back to the mechanic shop like the, it's a little distance but you know I, i'm not this is perfect i'll take it oh you'll take it like just like that yeah I don't even it. want to know the history, because you've been asking the history for all the other places. I mean, you know, probably going to be the worst one. What is the history of this place? I mean, it's not going to change giant... my mind, but... Yeah, it was a big, fat cannabis farm until it was raided by what? the uh, San Andreas State Police a few months ago. That makes this I place got this better. Place... Yeah, well, it's it's still got some, some of that good, good growing over there. Really? But, um, yeah, it was a giant shootout. Like, six people died. Well, I no, mean... No police, of course. It was it was a biker gang, you know? I believe they were called the, uh... Ah, crap. What's the name? Lost. The Lost Motorcycle Club. Oh, is that the gang that relocated to that trailer park? Yeah, they make meth there now. They, they, yeah. They've left, uh left cannabis behind them. Thank God. Didn't make as uh, much money. Because if it was any other kind of biker gang, I'd fear that they could try to come back here. But the law seems to be methed out of their mind in that location. Well, not only that, but the laws have been in severe decline. Yeah, I mean, they I heard them They haven't robbed the 24-7 in a couple months, which is a, a record. Yeah. But thank God. But yeah, no, I, I I will take this place. This seems like home to me. Well, uh, sounds like a plan. One second. All right, guys. I think honestly, this is this is a sick place to live. Uh, like we got the. Hey man, did there. you fill out some paperwork? All right, man. Hey, we'll so go is my this going to be car. a direct transfer, or do you need a uh? Or are you going to need a home loan? If uh, you need a home loan, then you need to talk to the bank before me. This is going to be a direct transfer. Okay, that that sounds good. Yeah, uh, about a, I came into some money about like a month ago, so like, all I've been, that's how I was able to buy the shop. Yeah. Hey man, your, your, your trunk is actually pretty flat, so... Yeah, just, we'll uh, it right here. Sign here. Next uh, week or so. All right, the uh, transfer good. comes in. It stay good if I don't get the transfer with the not come in the mail, and these this paperwork will be shredded. So, all right. Yep. When, when's the when's the day I can move in? Uh, you can go ahead and start moving in, but like I said, if I don't get that paperwork, then I I you're you're a uh, what's it called? I'm S O L on the house. I'm moving, and I'm pretty sure well, my credit will you, go to shit. Yeah, you're gonna get kicked out. So, and your credit will go to crap. Yeah. Yeah, I'll be sure to do. I'll well, uh, probably I'll probably do that first thing in the uh, in the morning. You know. Yeah. Hey, wait. Where's your, where's your office located so I can drop off the rest of the stuff? Uh, uh, at this time, I'm having an office built. Just uh, go by the sheriff's office and drop it into a PO box. That's the best that we can do right now. All right. Yeah. I can do that. Or if you can do a direct wire transfer to the uh, Lee Real account, that would be also. It's gonna be Lee Realty Incorporated. All right, and then what was the uh, the number I'm transferring it to? Uh, you really don't need the number as long as you just uh, say that you're transferring it to my account. They have it set up because I've already sold quite a few houses around here, so. Alright, um, alright, sounds good. I'll go, actually, I'll probably go take care of this now. It still seems to be midday. Yep. Um, alright, man, thank you. I appreciate this. Yep. Just, uh, call it if you ever need it. Uh, I'm active from about 6 to 4. Okay, okay. Um, yeah, I'll make sure to keep in touch. You know, I'm probably gonna throw a yeah. 
a house party or something. I mean, this is all secluded, so I can actually I can get away with a lot of things here. I mean, not illegal stuff. Yeah, but like I'm saying, check like, this out. I usually don't ever get to do this, but check this out. What's a good try? What's a good uh, target? Oh, Barrels there's a blue barrel. Right there. Where's the blue barrel? Oh yeah, I see it. Right there, sir. Oh jeez, that scared me. Gotcha. Damn. And I bet you they couldn't even hear that from the street. Yeah, you couldn't. Actually, you might. Like, I, I could definitely hear that from the street. My gun is very loud, if you know what I'm saying. Yeah, but my gun's, uh... <laughs> heavy revolver, man. That thing dings louder than it actually shoots. Yeah. Alright, though. Well, I appreciate everything you've done for me. Uh... And, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll see you on the flip side, man. Thank you again. I really appreciate it. I'm gonna go take care of all this stuff so I don't lose my house now. Yeah, I gotta go and get my car washed because it got dirty driving out here in Grape Seat. Yeah. It was just... Uh, have a good one. Alright, guys. Welcome to our new home. Um... I think... We are going to have a lot of cool things here for us to be able to do, and we even got our very own weed farm. We can make a lot of side cash on this. And, um, you know, we got our farm too. We got cows. We have a ranch here, and it's mine. I am dumbfounded about this all right before i lose this house i'm gonna go take care of this um anyways if you guys like that video make sure you like and subscribe please i'm getting very excited about making videos for this youtube channel and um i know recently i've been uh changing a lot of my names um but that is a lot of just personal stuff that I'm trying to do. I'm trying to fix my emails and stuff. But, um, yeah, I'm sorry for all the changes recently. But, uh, all right, guys, if you guys enjoyed that, please just, you know, just stay tuned. You know, hit that bell notification, whatever it is. All right. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out.